Hello and welcome to Be Open at Auto Club. Uh, we are the number one car today, unfortunately. It's a bit of a late night race, but I was too eager. I wanted to give this a try. I've, had, uh, I've enjoyed this track in the past, so I wanted to give it a, a go here in the B car. Got my setup from OSR. Seems to be all right. Uh, I haven't really done any laps with full tape on it, so this ought to be interesting because I do have it at 100% right now. We'll see if the engine even makes it all two laps. Hopefully it'll be all right. But uh, these long straights, I figure you do want that extra power. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, that's loose. Oh, okay, oh. Well, that was not ideal. Oh man, that was so much more loose than I expected. Um, interesting. Well, this lap is really bad. Maybe uh, lap two is where you want to give it a actually start pushing because wow that was like driving on ice there for a moment so hopefully it sticks a little better lap too because that wasn't that wasn't very good yeah I didn't I didn't hit the black ice this time, at least. That's a positive. With a little more practice, I really think I could uh, get better laps. I didn't get quite as much practice as I wanted. I was a little indecisive whether I wanted to sign up for this one, and so I kind of got into it a little bit late, but uh, uh, at least that's better than the first lap. But I know I left a whole lot on the table there. But, uh, tape held in just fine. We're not even in the red zone yet. We're, we're going to be getting there in a moment, though. But uh, we'll move that back down to, uh, I believe it has it at 74%. That's where we're going to be wanting to be. And I've got 14 to 1 steering ratio, because I figured it was going to be kind of loose at certain points. And I've kind of settled into using 14 to 1 as my go-to, rather than 16 to 1. It's just nice having that little bit of extra control over it, a little bit extra response time, and I uh, trust myself to remember not to just yank the wheel if I want to get it turned, to use my uh, pedals instead. It seems to be working out for me, so it's all good with me. We're about to blow up now. Maybe we can uh, get a... Uh, Pit stop attempt here, just in case we have a green flag pit stop. Ooh, that was a pits. little fast. Didn't give us the black flag, but I would probably want to be a little more careful than that. Even though that was pretty, pretty good entry. I don't want to take it that close to the edge. But uh, I have a good, pr uh, pretty good visual aid to know when to start getting on the brakes. So I think I should be able to get it done. If uh, we do need to get those green flag pit stops in. After that short run there, we're 97-97. That's a good sign. That's obviously just short run there, but... Good to see anyway. We're down to fifth. That's uh, perfectly fine with me, because I definitely feel like I left, like I said, left a lot of time on the table. Unless number five in practice had a 40.3. That might have uh, had some draft to do with it or something, but it left me wondering if I was way off pace. I guess we're fine. Definitely feeling good with my free setup. Not too worried about uh, worry about that then. Just got to execute now. 
Hopefully we'll do all right, and hopefully we won't get too many cautions. Very big, wide track. It seems like sometimes we can get uh, some good long green runs here. So long as guys uh, are kind to one another. It's uh, lots of room for people to catch mistakes and things. All right, we're ready to go. That was pretty quick. Good stuff. We'll get session last lap up right away. Top five with a lap that really is far from my best, so feeling good about that. I don't know. I don't even know if that uh, high line is really where you want to be running, but that's just where I'm most comfortable. I mean, <laughs> I still like nearly spun it on the first to lap, but I'm sure it was even more loose on the low side on those cold tires. But if I, if I can run the high line, that's what I'll do. If that's not uh, where you like to run, then chances are it's probably not even the best line around. You might even want to be like a lane down for qualifying. I don't know. I haven't watched anyone run this yet. I'm coming in here with my own my own guesses of, you know, where the braking... Are. There's no braking. There's the liftoff points. Turn in and everything. This is just me jumping in. So... I might be bet. I might do better if I were to watch some video first. Imagine Gavin's probably going to do one of these this week if he hasn't already. I look forward to watching that, and I'm looking forward to this as well. This race, I think it could be pretty fun. What I was starting to say before is that uh, I run the high line qualifying. Don't think that's where I want to be. For tire saving, I think I'm going to uh, enter high, but then kind of cut down, maybe. Five, you know, lift off pretty good and let the car naturally um, come down the track. I say cut down, but really it's more like just to let, let the we need to follow car, number car drift down the, the track. Column. You'll see what I mean. That's, sir. Uh, that's really what I want to do. That's what I'm going to go for. Line up on the inside. Pit road is closed right now. Catch the five car. Not sure uh, what gear we're going to want to start in. Maybe second. Second gear. Since I'm not using the brakes, I got my brakes at, I think it's like 60%. So that way I'm not looping myself on pit entry, hopefully. I'm pretty good at being bad at that. So. Hopefully that'll be okay. This is a pretty easy pit road to get onto, though, it seems. I don't think it should be much of an issue. Looks like a second gear start. I like where we are on the inside line. Good place to be, I think. Looks like we uh, are okay. Let's get, hit the gas. Hopefully, guys will be a little bit patient. So there's a long way to go. Oh, well, it's kind of. Right, checking the field. Keep low. This is gonna be real loose, so I gotta be ready. Hmm. Sorry, three. I did not mean that. Inside. Thankfully, you left the lane for us Still there. there. Clear. Car inside. Nice one, Colton. Clear inside. Uh, I'm in a weird spot. I got trapped for a moment. Stay high to the car on the low side. This thing just took off. You're now in third. Still there at the bottom. Stay high to the car on the low side. Stay high. 
Leah. This is already pretty fun. I love that uh, we have so much choice for these lanes. Guy got loose. Still there, hold your line. The next car's the leader. Stay low. Didn't even really plan on passing him. Clear outside. Car outside. Car inside. drafted. Caution, yellow flag. Line up, single file. Pit road is closed. Sorry, before Josh, I thought you saw me coming. Pace cars out. Line up, single file. Alright, well, we made it up to second already. Pace cars out. You can't keep bending like that, man. That was bad, man. 8.5 seconds. Pace cars out. You got a pass, man. Got our crew chief ready to tell us all about stuff. I'm just clutching for fun right now. <laughs> I'm not trying to save fuel. It's passing the time. This car's right there. Hey, we're uh, after the race. You got a minute to talk about the D car? Yeah, sure, man. I don't know if the three took exception to, to uh, us uh, drifting out towards the wall in front of them there. I mean, There's I didn't no cut him off that hard, I don't think. I think he had plenty of time to move to the inside. Maybe he just decided to bump draft. I didn't think I cut him off that bad. I just wanted to take a natural open. line out to, to the wall. Are open. So, I don't really think that was anything worth getting upset about, but that's not my call to make if he gets upset about something or not. Definitely not pitting. Can if you want to. I'm not even going to pretend. Hopefully we get some green laps. I think we're capable. Pit road is closed right Especially now. once the tires we're warm up. Pit's guys closed. are getting less loose. I think we should be okay. Man, it's a real shame I'm the one car, though. I don't like that pressure being say like, hey, you're supposed to win this. Like, I don't know about that. I don't know if I'm supposed to win any race. I think it just accidentally happens sometimes. I'm more of like a get a solid top five, just top ten kind of driver. <laughs> Not a I'm going to go out and win every race kind of driver. I don't think I'm aggressive enough to like go out there and make all the daring moves to get the wins all the time. Like, nah. I'm just as happy, pretty much, with a top five. Wins are exciting, obviously. But, like, top fives feel pretty good, too. And I'm not about to wreck myself trying to win every race or something. Not the, uh, if you're not first, you're last. Oh, that's just goofy. We're under caution. It's closed. So we're going to one to green already. That was pretty quick for a big track. Felt like that went by pretty quickly. We'll be uh, starting P2, unfortunately. We'll have to do this number. Always not so great at that. Looks like we're fine on tire spin, though. Not something to worry about. One to go. Next time by, you're on the outside this time. Okay, Was he the guy that uh, got the pole? He might have been. I can't remember. But uh, I'm just wondering if he's going to do that brake checking thing again. I don't really think he kept up with uh, pace speed. I could be wrong. It could have just been the way it looked because of guys behind him kind of stuttering. So it was kind of a weird start to the race. Regardless, we're just going to be looking and uh, hitting the gas when he goes. Seven point six gallons. Uh, keep uh, 
keep an ear on that fuel situation. Get enough cautions, we might not actually need to come in. We'll see about it, though. Obviously, we won't come in for tires if we get those cautions. So, might as well take fuel in that case anyway. So, maybe that's a redundant thought. Alright, gonna have to pay attention now. He's slowing down again. Yeah, that's a fine enough start. Easy does it. Be loose. Good. It's kind of what I was talking about, the line I'm going to be taking. Enter high, let it just uh, drift down low. I don't want to pass this guy yet. I'm okay with pushing him. Maybe we can even get some distance on the field. That'd be kind of cool. And uh, just try to get the heart rate down for a moment here. Take a breath. We're in no hurry to get anywhere. Not on lap nine. You passed this lap for a clock, forty point nine. That was uh forty one point one. I wanna try to use that seam a little bit maybe. Down there, maybe get it turned a little bit. I think that's kinda of what I wanna be aiming for anyway. Maybe if I can hit that consistently, that'll be uh something good for us. Here, yeah. I underdrove it there, but you get the idea. Let's try to avoid any major mistakes for now. And enjoy the drive! Sun's in our eyes, though. We can get the sunglasses on. It's California sun. Maybe I want to cut all the way down to the bottom lane like that. That felt that feels pretty good. Not sure. Learning as I go along here. Kind of nice having this guy's draft. And take the corners a little softer and then make up uh, that time just by following behind him. Theoretically. We're breaking away though, this top three though. Because uh, fourth place is a full second behind. already feeling a little bit tighter. Maybe I'm overdriving it. It really doesn't feel like I am, but maybe I am. I'm really not getting loose on throttle anymore. I kind of wish it would. The warning about the water temperature from the crew chief. Okay, Colton, that's good consistency. Keep it up. 
is a little sensitive with that information. Always seems to give it when you don't need it. But, uh, we'll see if that develops into anything. I trusted the setup builder. Wrecking on the back. Uh oh, wrecking. Caution though, not yet. Trusting the setup builder with the tape. Trusting that they uh, got it in the right spot where it's not going to blow on me. Because I want every little bit of tape I can get on a track this big. So much uh, throttle. Hey, what are you doing, man? Am okay with where we are, though? This is a very good spot to be in. It's going through center corner harder than we are. It's probably just driving it normally, though. I don't know if that means he, he's probably not even uh, stressing his right front. He's probably just uh, not underdriving it like I am. I'm pretty sure I'm underdriving it, but I really don't know. I'm, not, I'm much less familiar with the B car than, say, the Arca car. I still have a lot to learn for the Arca car, so. These are just my thoughts. Sure, it's all far from reality. I got this uh, number nine closing in on us a little, maybe. This guy not to run in the back of me. <laughs> Certainly entered harder than we did. The car outside. Still there. Outside. That's gonna work for him up there. Leave the top open for him, so it looks right. like he's going to get the run on us. Stay low. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Clear high. Put him on by. No need to fight for it right now. That seems like I'm falling off. I'm not sure. Taking the high line. I just feel like that's gonna kill it. As much as I would like to run up there. Let me see how it works here. Your engine temperatures are now back to normal. Engine tips are fine. It's no longer even a concern for the crew chief, so. It is no concern to me either, then. Maybe I do want some brake. Maybe I should have, uh. You should consider that. Trying different things. I 
guess this guy just likes bunk crap, yeah. Fair enough, I guess. He wants to make me go faster instead of just going around me. We need a lot of off-throttle time. Get the high side open for him again. There's some serious bumps on this track. There's some spots on the back <laughs> on the back straight. Feels like you're going off of mini ramps. strange. I feel like I haven't pushed the car even a little, but it's driving like I've uh, really driven the tires off of it. I really don't know what to make of it. Just done I felt like I was going so soft. And still am. Sure, are getting a good run off that high line though. Maybe I do want to be up here. Inside. No, this guy is not gonna drift Still up there. and hit me. Is he? Still there. Hold your line. Yeah, he really Drop dove it in. Right side. Two way, but it's a lap car for a moment. Still inside. Keep high. Clear inside. Bit foolish to just uh, try to pass him again, so we'll give him some push. Arrow push, not literal push like the other guy. He's doing like a, a slider line. Seems to be working. You're past us doing it. Nine gallons. Third, that lap was a forty-two point five. Probably a little harder there. I'm sure, that's what I want to be doing. Gotta lift off sooner than that. I'm gonna be faster through the uh, later part of the corner. Number five's really uh, made his way out there. Uh oh. Green the wall a tiny bit. Managed to not get it stuck up there though. Flame of fire. Justify staying up top like that. Seems like the higher line in one and two works better than the higher line in three and four. I think you want it to be a lane down in three and four. That's kind of what I'm getting. 
Seems like what those guys are doing, too. Alright, I'm, I'm figuring it out a little bit. What the uh, car wants from me. Happened to the uh, end of the nine. They get in the wall or something. I didn't even notice they're falling off a cliff all of a sudden. Hmm. Well, we got some caution laps at the start. So I'm going to factor that into how I want to do my strategy here if we end up having to do green flag stops. Oh, I forgot to hit the... <laughs> forgot to get off the gas. Apparently a good idea to use some lifting. Slider going on. But, uh, it's a bit past halfway is probably where I want to be. Coming in. in front is now These guys uh, look like they're gonna be fighting hard, though. This could be gay. Could be something interesting to watch. Here for a minute. They certainly aren't gonna catch the leader doing that. Alright, so high line one and two. And then uh turn down a little bit. Three. Gotcha. Kim's gonna be working for us. More snaking around. And I wouldn't be so opposed to just working together here. Be, uh, use the draft to our advantage and catch the guy up there instead of trying to break the draft. Of course, you can't really just communicate that to everybody. I mean, you can. It's a microphone, but <laughs> so I don't think anyone's ever going to go along with that. Not a, unless you're on the same team. And at a weird corner. Still there, hold your line. Clear. You're back in fourth position. What happened to the nine there? They kind of got tied on exit, maybe? Ended up heading toward the wall. Had the lift off. Lost all their momentum, though. When do we come in? We lap 40. About lap 40. Okay, Colton, that's good consistency. Keep it up. Still uh, kind of swapping around there. Messed up the entry there a little bit. Stuck my turn in. It's okay though. Coming up here. Yeah. It would be a shame to get uh, caught by a yellow flag though. I'm kind of worried about that as well. Get guys going to the pits. I don't know. I don't know if you can play that game though. I think we just gotta come in. Let 40 or so.
Miss my darn turn in again. Keep taking turns three and four like one and two. After what I've learned. Uh, to see when the leader decides to come in. Damn, the leader's checked out. It's not that bad. Six seconds, I've seen worse. Jeff, my, he's, an, he's an AI. That last lap, he was five tenths selected on the whole field. Probably a sandbagger kind of food as a room is other shit. I can't spaz on the whole field, really? Oh, that's crazy, man. I mean, I've caught y'all well, Maybe he's better. Out, but that's crazy <laughs> I think. going that fast. Yeah, I'm underestimate. Or uh, under I mean, appreciated in this game. Jeff, tell him what you're sponsored by. I think I'll stick to lap 40, maybe. Come in right about then. I believe he's running elite. Sponsored by elite. I'm checking if I'm wrong. Exactly. Keep going. Sponsored by a setup. Yeah, won't buy EPI. Your inner track infection? That's a U. He said EPI. Put it in. 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 Alright. I'm using EPI too and I ain't that bad. I was gonna say, there ain't no way that's stop it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we'll come, come in next lap up. then. It'll be about fine. That's it. I think I'll be able to save the second half of the race better yeah, now that I kind of know how to run yeah, it, yeah, too. I mean, it might be. You might just be that much better than everyone, but uh, you make your own changes to it. When you get hired as a driver, you get the better setup. That's like with any other um, setup shop. You go and buy a setup, you still got to do your adjustments to it to make it quicker for you. Now, 2.4 seconds. I wanted to say pitting in, but talking about setups. Now, when you go to the website, it says that was a so really weak entry. I was too afraid. You to the end of the race. Better too slow than too fast, I guess. Off every time you're out. Which you also got to be a good driver, they just don't give that to anybody. Box in, and Jeff five, is a great driver, but... Four, oh my god, please, three, I'm trying to focus. Two, one. Box now. That process was kind of weak there. Wow, 65.82. What am I doing? Right, so I'll back it down earlier in the run this time. That's it, go! There's traffic behind, keep your wits about him. The leader's pitching now, he's just pitching. Alright. What are you doing? Get away! Three wide, car outside, two wide. Outside is clear. Come up right behind me. Outside. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Clear. Go for the pass whenever I'm trying to check in. Oh, are you kidding me? Is this good or bad? <laughs> Surely we have people stay out, right? Uh, now how's this going to cycle out? Lee Lap. That's good. It's fine, you got loads. Oh. 
I don't know how this is going to psych up. So guys are going to pit. We basically got fresh tires. I think that's good for us. Catch that ball, Chuck. I don't know, man. Deep roads open. Pits are open. The uh, brought us back to the leader. The leader's in fifth now. Of course, I'm sure the people in front of him are going to be pitting, right? Maybe not all of them, I don't know. I'll just have to wait and see how this turns out. The leader is pitting now. Catch that five, car. Car, 24, got the lucky dog, let them pass on the outside. I was, I was looking at another guy, I think, not the leader. Caution. It's closed. It's the leader's right here. Okay, that makes sense then. We're in third. That's about right. Seemed to cycle out normally. Hope that I can uh, save the tires a little bit better this time. Maybe I'll use a tiny bit of brake. So the six tires are going to be a little bit older. Ours are basically brand new fresh. Got like maybe one lap on them I think. Like a half lap. I think the number fives tires are pretty uh, new as well. We're under caution. Pits are closed. Very interesting. I'm glad we didn't get trapped or anything. By whatever happened there. One to go. Next time by, you'll be lining up on the Race inside. In now I know a little bit more about, uh, how I want to be driving, I think. Did, that guy just merged on another track without taking the pit exit. He just gave himself a penalty. Maybe he already got a penalty for entering close pits, so he just, like, forget about it. I was dashing at Had that muted for a while. Yeah, back for We gotta go. Right. About to go green. Stay focused. Getting a shorter run to the end. The pace car is in. Green, green, green flag. Green flag. Back <laughs> in third. Keep hustling. Three. Outside. The next car's the leader. Still there. Clear. Full tires, I guess. Anyone putting in? Inside. 
stay high with the car on the low side. Clear inside. So let's be disciplined here and be nice to the tires. You're back in second. Okay, Colton. Cup times are pretty consistent. Okay, you take that right. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Still there. Still there, hold your line. Oh, well, I still need a lap. Good save, yes. Dan. Stay low. We have the new leader. Our lap time was 41.0. Outside, clear. Turning. Car inside. Keep high. Clear. Car inside. Stay high. Still inside. Still inside. Clear inside. The next car's the leader. Car inside. Clear inside. I'm trying to drive it like I was when the tires were old, so that way I can uh, look at it later. Car outside. Still there. Go low. Clear outside. Outside. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Stay low. It is. Still there, hold your line. This is my blind spot. Outside, clear. Car outside. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Didn't quite clear him. Still there, hold your line. That we might for a second. Still there. Clear high. Car outside. Still there. Clear up top. Clear them. That was closer than I thought it was going to be, though. Inside. Keep high. Keep high. Clear Got inside. Got ran in the back of me. Come on, man. Let's not play this game. I want to lose. Because we're going to be swapping spots all afternoon. Inside. Stay high. Clear. Where this guy's gonna run in the back of me. Oof. This is interesting. This is very, very interesting. Gonna drive it like I have old tires on it already. Watch water temperature. It's looking a little high. Be 
You know this five wants it back after that huge lead he had. No idea how to stick tires in this thing. It's just hard to tell what the car's even doing half the time. This guy. Cutting it way too close. You really gonna stick your nose like that? Dangerous move. Clear up top. I'm glad they're tearing this piece of shit down. Alright. I agree with the eye this track. Before, the lap time was at 42.0. This guy slides up and hit Andrew bad. He dove in there like 12,000 feet back. <laughs> Ooh, turn, Jesus. Just kept getting closer and closer to the wall. Scared me. Slider line was working pretty well for him. Clear inside. Car's too tight to make that work. Head to go, lift on by. He's on. Yeah, he's now ready. back in the lead. I feel like this four is either going to go up there and win it or go up there and wreck someone. Probably going to be one of those two. Just, I can't do what he's doing there. That cut down. Just have different setups, I guess. Something that comes. Well, I didn't touch you. I didn't say you did, you don't have to touch someone with to like, fuck their race up by blocking unnecessarily and shit. Hey, he's keeping pace, I don't think he's doing anything wrong. Oh, wow, what a slider. Okay, he's I didn't say that. I need to call the stewards and have him arrested, did I? I just said he's being a prick, you're annoying. That's all. Then Five's on, on his way out again. He's got good long run speed for sure. You want that? Make it easy for you, Jesus, man. Being a little baby about it. 
Uh, what are y'all getting heated for? It's been a good race. I don't know. I guess you guys never played iRacing before. If you haven't been annoyed by a back marker getting in your way unnecessarily, I guess they can do it. They got the right. It's whatever. It's just a quick move, that's all. So why bitch about it? Just go on about your race. That's the reason they make these things a button, you know? You talk about a back mode being in your way, but you're nowhere near the front either. Unfortunately. All right, be quiet. <laughs> Gosh. So grumpy. People are like, oh, I hate this track. Oh, I'm having a horrible race. Oh, back markers. Like, all right, already. Leave the complaining to me. It's uh, all my complainings. And nobody on YouTube. <laughs> we might lose this top five. I've got horrible. I'm horrible with saving these tires. I'm doing something wrong. I think I need to be braking on a tree or something. I have no long run speed whatsoever. You got five left to go. Just, it won't turn anymore. It's so frustrating. Still there, inside. Clear inside. This thing just. I, I mean, I guess I'm overdriving it. I feel like I'm doing everything everyone else is, and I don't even feel like I'm pushing it hard. I feel like if I had choice over it, I would start this thing up much looser because I wasn't even fighting it loose off the start. Not even a little. Sixth place. Just will not turn. What is going on? Why is it so bad this run? Man, I mute the mic and now I'm the one complaining a bunch. But holy cow, man. This thing's awful. So I don't know what I even did different. I, I thought this time I did better. I was starting off like trying to take it more easy in the corners. But it ended up much worse. I don't know. It stopped turning. It's terrible. You've got two laps to go. Still there, inside. It would be one thing if I like pushed it really hard. I'm just very unhappy with what this setup is though, to be honest with you. I feel like I didn't push it hard at all and it got so tight. Right, lower line. One flag. One more left to go. Hold this guy off one more time. B6. White flag. Last lap. That was at 42.9. Jesus. It just it, it, it won't turn. Look at that. I was off the gas the entire corner. It just will not turn. <laughs> it's unbelievable. At least the guy behind us had issue or something too, because my god. Maybe I just didn't know how to drive it, but not too happy with how the setup turned out there. Or maybe that's just how this car drives here, I don't know. P6, 
Good race, guys. Thought I was going to have you there at the end, Kevin. Great job. You did really well. Good race. Oh. Let me get the mute. Good goal, Alpha. Yeah, it was a good race, guys. Good win, number five. I'm going to hop in your Discord, guys. Right? Want to find a safe place to park it? Fun racing with you there, Colm. Good race. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, you're in that one, man. That was that was some good running. He was real fast. All right. P6. That's fine. Yeah, yeah, 24. That's pretty good. I know I'm the number one, but as I was saying from the start, I'm usually the top five, top ten kind of sorts. So, I'll take it. Let's uh, see what happened out there. Let me see my tires. 74.89. I swear it was... I don't know. That was not my favorite setup. Maybe it's just uh, meant for a driving style that's different from mine. So maybe it's not even the setup's fault. It's just I wasn't driving it as intended. Who knows? Wasn't a very good fit for me, though, I don't think. Ooh. I was curious. So that 24 was obviously off pace off of the corner. And 21 tries to sneak it on the outside, and... There wasn't room there. And the 13 gets taken out. Or, uh, sorry, I was blanking out there. It got loose. In front of the 15. 15 had nowhere to go. So I'm kind of tired. I need to go sleep after this or something. <laughs> with a precaution. Two. Touching the wall just a smidge. This is going to be... Ooh. Yeah, I was going to say safer barrier on entry, but I don't think he actually hit it. Whoa! I, I didn't realize they were off, that off pace and that 18 came out of nowhere. 14 struggling through the corner, getting loose. They have some serious problems controlling that thing. The slide job gone wrong. Whoa, Nick Code made that so much worse than it needed to be, too. And this guy end up finishing second. Yeah, he was fast. He was making that work, but this time it didn't work. Glad he didn't end up doing that to anyone up front. Like me. <laughs> That's just a pretend wall hit. Tide car gets the safer barrier on entry. Your team's getting loose again. They have a real loose race car apparently, but uh, it's the wall that gets it this time. Tree. Nothing. Ooh. Some serious issues going on there. Wall on entry. Wall on exit. What we got here? Wall on entry. Sir. Guy's name. It's a guy or gal is named Raven. I wonder if it's a nickname or if that's really their name. Mowing the lawn though. Sorry. I got really tired all of a sudden. I can't see this car, so I can't tell you what they did. It's camouflage. Whoa. 21 forgot <laughs> to let off the gas. Well, Depot's gonna get doored. Ooh, they got it bad, too. Ugh. 
Oh, okay, so this guy did get in the wall and I didn't see it. He got at the wall pretty good, too. I'm wondering how uh, everyone caught up to him so quick. And there's your answer. He didn't have fishing. He had problems, right? Yeah, back to 14th. I remember seeing him a lap down at one point. I wonder, uh, I don't think that that right there put him a lap down, though. Or that far back, for that matter. I imagine he had more problems later. And we might be about to see it. Ah, uh, just still a minor thing. Hold on entry. Probably looking at that 15 coming up on him. Yeah, this 15 was having a great run. Number 15 car in 4th place at this time. Back to 8th, but that's still really good for the, fourth, or for the 15. 18 also had a great run. Good for them. That's good stuff. This is a pit entry. Not sure why we're seeing it. Looks pretty uh, well executed. Is this the caution that happened during the stops? It would not appear so. Is this the caution? No, it's just a wall hit. It's coming soon, though. 23. One of the last to come onto pit road. They were not even coming on pit road. I, they were so s slow through the corner, I thought they were coming to pit road. Here's the caution, and it was the 9. So that's what happened to him and what brought out the caution. He got loose on... Uh, Oh no. Okay, what happened? Wait a minute. That already says caution. He's wrecking under caution. So what brought out the caution? Because... I don't know how he even did that. Loose tire, or cold tires, I guess, because he was just under pit lane. Well, what brought out the caution then? Pace car's already out. Well, no, I gotta know. This was a major turning point in the race. Not that guy. He's getting loose, but it's not that guy. Oh, there it is. Oh, wow, the 15. Okay, so they bounced back. They got the get-out-of-jail-free card. They got loose on the cold tires. And that's what brought it out. Their own caution <laughs> saved them. I guess it's kind of how it works, but... Huh. All right. Honest mistake. He bounced back pretty well. And then uh, we saw all this. This is nine wrecking under caution. That's a bitter pill to swallow. And we're back under green here as the 16 goes up and hits the wall. Just some more wall. Nineteen gonna get him. Ooh. Nineteen hit the brakes, so they wouldn't. They were about to. Thirteen's been loose all race. Looks like he's chasing it up the track and into the wall. I wouldn't mind giving their setup a try. I would, would have really liked a looser race car. Seventeen forgot to hit, let go of the brakes or let go of the throttle. Let go of the brakes. All right, zooming along here. Got to see. Oh no. What is, what's that? That's rude. Rude. You're rude. What was that? You know, you have to actually clear a guy if you're going to do a slide job. That's just the rudest, crudest thing I ever did see on a racetrack. I would be upset about that one. Nine has some more troubles. That's a bummer. They were in second at one point. Imagine three did not like that move. I thought he might get into the back of him. 
out of displeasure. So that did not happen. That's gonna be some heavy wall. Hmm. Firm hit. I don't think the nine scar is working properly anymore. I think he's got damage and it's making it all all the stuff worse for him. Can't see the scar. Wall. Wall. Lots of wall. Nothing. Oh. Race is over. And uh, the 13 is celebrating a top 10 finish. You do you! Congrats on the top 10, 13. We ended up with a P6. Not my best. I can't be too upset about that, though. Just barely outside the top 5. Uh, I feel like I could probably learn a little bit, run it a little better. I was, I was not completely certain where the car wanted to go or where it should have been going with the line and maybe I should have been using a little brakes on entry I'm not sure I I think uh, you know I probably would have preferred a looser setup but I also can't just blame it on that I feel like if I knew how to how to drive this particular setup it could have uh, maybe had better results but uh, I'll take it just a solid run um, it was a clean one got ourselves a zero X so solid race I'll take it. Hope you enjoyed watching, and uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks.